We are the proud parents of daughters with Rett syndrome. Strong, powerful, beautiful, remarkable girls and women that we are lucky to call our own. Despite the devastating effects of Rett, their strength and their resilience inspires and empowers us. Every day we watch them fight agonizing symptoms, and yet we still see a spark in their eyes, a glimpse of hopes and dreams that persevere within, a spark that refuses to be extinguished. But that spark that we see in their eyes is just that, a spark, a glimpse of who our daughters really are, what they are capable of, who they might become. We share photos and videos that highlight the best moments of our days. But those moments are fleeting, mere seconds when we're able to catch a glimpse of their true selves beyond the prison of Rett syndrome. It's also those moments when we're painfully aware of all that Rett has stolen from us. We're grateful for the glimpses, but they are only glimpses of what truly lies within our daughters' minds and hearts. Despite all this, we remain optimistic about the future. We're holding fast to that spark in our daughter's eyes and imagining what it will become once we have a cure. We dream about their personalities, their joy, their love, and their laughter, freed from the cruelties of Rhett. We are optimistic in large part due to the remarkable progress we've seen in research. It gives us a very real likelihood that the glimpses we now see of our daughters will become so much more. Through research, the glimpses can shift to hours and days and months and years where our daughters can be their real and true selves. We need more families to step up and fundraise for the research and more of their relatives and friends to make this their leading cause. We need more people to understand that this is a cause for which their contributions can lead to a huge impact on lives. Time is of the essence. We can wait no longer for the glimpses we see of our daughters to turn into much more than a flicker. This is within reach scientifically. With your help, we can make the cure a reality. Our children are waiting.